New tonight, a dismembered body found in a barrel. We're now learning more about the man police say put the victim in there and what they say led up to that murder. Kim Passoff looking through the evidence presented to a grand jury is live outside the Clark County Detention Center with more. Yeah, so this is Ryan Bentley. He is locked up here tonight. Police say that he is behind a grisly murder. In November, a contractor for Public Works found an abandoned barrel, and when he opened the lid to see if it contained any hazardous materials, he was hit by the stench of decomposing flesh. These are new pictures where investigators say the murder took place. Bullet holes through a garage door continuing through to hit the outside of a home. On November 29th, human remains, a head and torso missing its arms, were found in a barrel near Russell and Mountain Vista, along with a bottle of bleach. The victim, identified by the Clark County Coroner's Office as Renee Olamos Enriquez Jr., reported missing earlier in the month. Hello, this is a free call from an incarcerated individual at Clark County Detention Center. Hello. That is one of a series of jailhouse calls prosecutors say Bentley made when he was arrested. First, right after the murder, and then later, after he was released, disposed of the body in the barrel, and again was arrested. I have, I haven't. I, uh, I went, I went past it. But they don't know. They don't know. Does the house have been done? Yeah. Uh, who? Police were first called to the area where the murder occurred for reports of gunshots, but there was no evidence at the time that Bentley was the one who'd fired them. Bentley was arrested for narcotics possession. This is a copy of a search warrant response from Meta, the parent company of Facebook, handing over information about Bentley's online conversations. Investigators say it helps prove his involvement. Quote, I either need new Sawzall blades or Cash App so I can ride bike to buy some. I just need hot water to activate the lie. Angelica was here. She helped me fill up that drum. Bro, the blank me and her had to do compared with cartel videos. And a second suspect, Angelica Hudson, was also charged with the murder, but the state has since dropped those charges. Right now, Bentley is facing murder charges as well as conspiracy to commit murder charges. Police say that Bentley believed that the victim was a snitch and had told police about his drug business. Reporting live tonight outside of the Clark County Detention Center, Kim Passoff, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. Bentley's arraignment hearing was scheduled for this Thursday, but it's now been continued. A new date has not yet been announced.